Now I'm going to show you how to recover your launcher if you um, mistakenly deleted it. So if you find yourself on this screen and you can't find your Bibles on launcher, I'm going to show you how to get that launcher back from the marketplace or from the Bibles on store. So um, when you see this screen, just tap OK and um, don't freak out because you don't see anything and you just see Jesus, which is really cool. So, um, so to recover your launcher, your Bible's on launcher, you're going to go ahead and tap on that little icon there. And then you're going to see your apps. Just hit OK if you see that, that pulls up. So you're going to still see your apps, but it, they're just not on the Bibles on Launcher. So I'm going to show you how to get those. So go to the Bibles on Store. Make sure you're connected to your Wi-Fi or Internet. Um, tap on the Bibles on Store, and we're going to find the Bibles on, for, in this case, the Kids Launcher. If you have the Bibles on uh, Adult Tablets, you're going to go ahead and look for that Bibles on Adult Launcher. So let's look for the Bibles on Kids Launcher. Um, well, I'm just going to show you how to get here. So we go back to the Bible Zone apps. And on the Bible Zone apps, we're going to look for the Bible Zone Kids Launcher. Just scroll down until you see, um, until you see that. So it's right here. Um, in this case, this is the Bible Zone Kids Launcher. If you have the adult tablets, you're going to look for the Bible Zone Adult Launcher, which is right there. Um, in this case, we're going to download the Bible Zone Kids Launcher. So I'm going to tap on that. And it says Bible Zone Kids Launcher, and we're going to install it. Just tap on it once and um, see if the process starts. If it doesn't, go ahead and do it a second time. There you go. So we're just going to give it a few moments and see what happens. It's running really slow, so it may take a little bit of time. And while this app is downloading, it's advisable not to do anything else. Just wait for the download to complete. Because if you try to do anything else, it may just slow the whole process and the performance of the tablet. It's at 24%, so let's just be patient. Okay, so once that download is completed, it would um, bring up this screen and just, just tap next and just keep going next. And now it says install. Go ahead and tap on install and it will be installing the new, uh, it will be installing the lost kids launcher. So you're going to have your launcher back again. There you go. It's done. Just tap on done. Okay, done. And then we're going to go to the home page and see what happens, okay? Now it's going to ask you to select what launcher you want to display your apps. Just go ahead and select Bibles on Kids and say always. taking a little bit of time okay so it's gonna take you back to the sign up screen just go ahead and enter your name and your information and I'll, I'll just do that for demonstration purposes and hit submit there you go so that's your Bible Zone Kids Launcher back recovered so you did not actually lose it. So um, then your tablet will be working nice and good again.